So what's up guys, DJ Vibes Games back here, and today we're back on the mowing slash roleplay series. And today, I didn't want to do it, but we're getting rid of the crawler. But, don't don't worry, don't worry, it's for a good reason. And I just realized now, what we're getting, we're going to need a bigger trailer. So while I get this thing unloaded, I'm going to explain to you what I'm getting. So, uh, basically... I was on Facebook Marketplace. I um I didn't know. I don't. I don't remember if I told you guys this. It, actually, it happened in between episodes. I sold the 2015 Razor. I I didn't really like how it was looking. Well, not that. No, it was just getting high on hours, and I didn't really like. I was getting kind of bored of the look, so I decided I was gonna sell it. And I was going to just save up a little money and try to get like a 2018 to 2021. 2021 being the best, 2018 being like the worst. So I was on Facebook Marketplace and I was strolling for a little bit. And then one of my buddies actually came over and he had a friend that he brought with him that I never met before. And they, we were hanging out, having a couple, have a couple of drinks, just hanging out uh, one night. And uh, his buddy was looking at my crawler. I was showing him off uh, all my toys because he really likes. Uh, he has like a bunch of razors and stuff. He told me, um, but he was like, "Hey, how much you want for the crawler?" I was like, "It's really not for sale." He said, "Ah, oh, come on, everything's for sale." I was like, mm, "Not, nah, I don't really want to sell it." He was like, "What about a trade?" And I was like, "It have to be a trade like really pointing towards me." And he was like. Alright, so I don't really know if I want to tell you guys right away. You know what? Whatever. I'm getting... He said he traded me his 2019 Razor Turbo. Not the Turbo S, just the Turbo. Um, and a Yamaha YXZ. So I'm getting two side-by-sides for this. And this, I haven't really got too much use out of. So, I mean, it's worth it. We got to drive quite far. I told him he didn't really have a trailer to, uh, at the moment to come pick it up. He runs like a side by side, like a used side by side dealership. So he's uh, he has a ton of them, but this these two were his personally. So he um, he said he's gonna trade me for this because he's really into crawlers. He had he bought one, but it didn't really crawl that well. And he had he saw this and was asking me questions like, how did where'd you get it? Did you build it? And I was like, no, I didn't build it. I bought it off some guy. I tri uh, I sold my uh, dually um, second gen and bought this for about 30k so I'm getting actually 20k or no I'm getting probably what the 2019 is about 25k and the YXZ is like 15k oh stupid car he hit me that is rude um, so I'm getting about a 10k difference with towards me which is always nice so, uh, yeah, I'm going to go up here, and I'm going to pick these things up. I'm probably not going to record it. He said he doesn't really like to be on camera. I was talking about my YouTube series. So, uh, I'm probably going to not record it, but uh, I will catch you guys. Ooh, that's a nice truck. I might have to stop pick that up. i right, back on track. I'll catch you guys when I'm back home. So, you guys already know I make great financial decisions, right? So I was at my, I was at that guy's house, uh, picking up some, picking up the toys. So as you guys can see, I got the Razor and the YXZ. And you can also see, I got a new Dodge. So, you know, that Dodge, I said, that was cool. That, when we passed it, I was talking about it to my, uh, my friend. Well, I call him my friend now because we're actually pretty good buddies. We sat and hung out first at his house for a couple hours. And, uh, he was actually best friends with that guy for years and uh he said that well, i'll talk while we get this unloaded here he said that that truck was actually for sale i paid 12 grand for this truck these trucks are going for like 18 19 20 grand right now it's a 5.9 cummins turbo diesel and it sounds beastly um i've already got a butt 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 load of prod yes butt load of project a butt but that's load of parts for it. So I ordered a color match bumper. I ordered a color match grill. I've got dark headlights, dark tear lights, a color match rear bumper, new wheels and tires, a five inch lift kit, con uh, country, 
color matched mirrors. Um, I got a hitch. I got a bed hitch. What else do I got for this? I got a bed pump. I got um, a. Sh I think I either ordered a shotgun stack or a regular stack. Um, I was uh, ordering a few parts after I bought it because I still hung out at my friend's house for a while. So uh, we'll leave that there for now. Let's get the YXZ off. Now I can start talking about that. So it's a white YXZ. It's pretty fast. It's a turbo. I don't even know if they make turbos. I don't know too much about this, but I knew that it was about 15 grand. Um, as you guys can see in this, actually, I want to put, I want to move this. I'm gonna start putting all the toys in this garage so I can park my white truck in this one uh, this one over here So uh, we'll open these doors. Let's move the bobcat over a little bit. Let's just uh, Park the bobcat behind this over here because we don't use it too much Still got the ramp down on that No one comes in this building. This building's secure. That's another reason I really like it over that rusty one um, So we're gonna put the toys inside this building for now just because I don't want my white truck to get all this sun damage from here. Because it gets quite hot here. So um, I want to keep it nice and in the shade. So that it doesn't get all these sun rots. That truck, I, it was 12 grand. That truck's like 120. So uh, there's the difference. I might put that truck inside my daily. I don't really, really care at all about that thing. That thing I hardly drive. I got it for a daily driver and I don't ever drive it. I hardly leave my property other than if I'm hauling trailers. So uh, we'll back that thing up there nice and neat. That's a 2019 rail Razor. It's got the trail edition. So it's pretty nice. It does have the turbo. It's not the turbo S package, but it does have the turbo. Um, we'll pull this thing over here. So yeah, back to talking about this. Um, the parts may come. They said they're coming. I got them. Day I spent a lot of money. I got them. Uh, next day shipped so those should be here tomorrow. I might cut and include it in this video but uh Yeah, so actually I am gonna do that So I'm gonna catch you guys tomorrow when we get the new parts, so I will see you guys then. Bye So guys, it's been Two days. It's now six o'clock on the second day and the trucks finally done So yesterday the truck was at the diesel shop and getting the lift kit installed and also getting um, the new exhaust installed. And then yesterday afternoon, I got, I had some problems with lighting. I had to go to the lighting shop. So, but I got everything on, every, all the parts came in. And now this is the truck reveal. Bam. It's so much sexier. So let me go over everything I did and shops did. So, starting off in the front, we got the nice custom grill. Um, if you if I jump in here, it's got lights. It's got it's got lights throughout the grill. That's what I was having problems with yesterday. And uh, I also told you guys, I didn't mention I got the light bar. I picked that up yesterday when I was at the lighting um, shop. So, uh, just because it was there. Um, we got the color match front bumper, which is nice. Um, LED black lights. In the back, we got the LED black lights. We got the color match rear bumper. Um, we got a 5-inch lift on some street tires. I know they're not the best looking, but uh, they kind of they're kind of close to the ones on the uh, Ford in there. It's inside because it's raining. I'm filming this video outside because in the rain for you guys. Uh, I put in, um, well, I had the shop put in these torsion bars. That's what took most of the day. I got the truck back at like 4 yesterday and had to run into the thing. It's on. Uh, they put it on airbags. It's got all that stuff in the rear. Um, what else? Um, I did get the 4th gen mirrors, their color match also. Um, it's got the one exhaust pipe that rolls cold. It's got a bed pump, which is nice. Uh, let's hop in here. I wish the door, the things were in the doors were color matched, but, uh, it matches the black stack. Stack. Ready? Start it up. Dang. We give it some gas. Ooh, look at how much coal that thing rolls. And it sounds good, too. So yeah, it's a it's lifted higher, and it basically did kind of like a halfway SEMA build. I actually want to pull it over here and check if the rims match. We're gonna park it there. Let's pull open up here. I'm not gonna pull it out because it's clean, but uh, let's see how well the rims match. So those are the ones on there. They're close. I mean, they're not exactly. Dang, this wheels need to be cleaned. 
They're not exact, but uh, they're close. So this is a new build. Um, it's pretty cool. It took two and a half days, so uh, that's what... <laughs> well, no, it took two days. This is like the end of the last day. We still got the Cummins back there. I don't remember if I um, told you guys. I think I got... I like red. That's the only not red truck I have. Well, I only have three trucks, but uh, I got two reds Cumminses. This is like uh, the race slash burnout truck. This is going to be like the show truck. I might pull this. I might troll. I still forgot to get the hitch and stuff, but uh, we'll get that later date. Um, I didn't have time. So, uh, yeah, um, I'm actually going to end the episodes here. It's uh, a little bit of a shorter one, I think. I haven't edited it down, but uh, yeah, I think it's a little bit of a shorter one. And I'm sorry about that, but uh, if you did enjoy, make sure you like, subscribe, and uh, I will see you guys later. Bye.